Brussels loves nothing more than endless debates about the future of Europe. Now, a very real glimpse of what that future looks like. The British Prime Minister was long gone. She left the remaining 27 leaders to mull the UK's future ties with the EU, with Britain no longer in the room. They say sufficient progress has been made on the breakup issues, money, Ireland and citizens' rights. The next step, giving chief Brexit negotiator Michel Barnier the job of kicking off talks on the future UK-EU relationship. There'll be a post-Brexit period of two years where Britain pays into the EU's coffers, but it will take rules rather than make them. But officials in Brussels want greater clarity from Britain. Talk about a deep and special partnership won't cut it for very much longer. We have not asked them to leave the European Union, so I think the Brits now have to decide what they want. I have not participated in the referendum and I would not have voted for the UK to leave the EU. We need to put into effect what the UK wants. The road ahead won't be easy for Theresa May. She'll have to overcome the differences in Parliament back home and potentially amongst other EU governments. James Franey, Euronews, Brussels.